Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Hello everyone, my name is High Priestess Ishra, and this is Samhain Edition 2019. Okay, I wanted to do something special for my YouTube followers, for my YouTube followers, and I wanted to do it my way, which is the Samhain way. You guys know I'm considered quote-unquote heathen, quote-unquote the chosen one from the chosen few, quote-unquote starseed indigo child. You guys enjoy this beautiful sowing that's happening like right now on the first full cycle of the full moon, October 27, 2019. We're going through this crazy energy flux of energy before the bigger energy flux in 2020. I guess that's what I'm going to call this, the coming on of 2020, Halloween 2019. Now, when we are dealing with Samhain, keep in mind you have to stay connected with the ancestors, whether you are a walking zombie or whether you are an enlightened one truly on this path, making sure that you are celebrating the paganistic holidays within their true fashion you, and you allow yourself the opportunity to utilize your power and rise and build okay now when we are dealing with Samhain or some people call it Sani or some people call it Halloween this is a holiday based off a very strong astrological portal day within the four seasons. So just know what you're practicing and know that you have to be safe out there because there are so many dangers out there during this time, especially Halloween, the 31st. There's a lot of nefarious energies moving and fluttering about and these nefarious energies have people thinking acting reacting very aggressively so please be careful out there on this halloween make sure you protect your children check the candy if you're one of those um ritualistic people that actually take their children out or allow their children out to go get candy be very careful candy is just another assistance to keep your child confused lost and a pain in your ass. Also, know that um, remembering your ancestors and connecting with alternate energies within the atmosphere can really be communicated very easily throughout this 31st portal opening of Halloween. Halloween. So, um, utilize the opportunity if you're not scared to talk with, to converse with, to build with outside energies because they are very giving. And as a high priestess, I'm receiving energy on a constant basis. And if you don't know how to matriculate your energy correctly, you'll allow this outside world to completely throw you off course. So just be careful. To my beautiful dark goddesses, we are finally here. And it's funny, a lot of you people get confused about what dark goddesses are about, because I am a dark goddess. Feel free to check out my business page at Dark Goddess 99 for all of your metaphysical needs. Or you can check my Facebook at Mel Sheba High Priestess for my daily free information on the awakening. Look out for that children book coming out to you really, really soon. It's going to be the High Priestess series, teaching children through books. Look forward to that. Look forward to that. Because I am. <laughs> Yay! Yay! I hope you're enjoying your full moon day, guys. Because I'm definitely enjoying mine. I'm really enjoying it. And I'm, I'm having a keen time. So much so. I want to vibe with you real quick. And let's get into a cipher. Tipped 
over them. of the lies that this earth tell you. You come from a dark source and through the power of your kundalini risings you can reach powerful levels to where <laughs> to where you can't be stopped. Yeah. All right, we're good. 